Today we're at Rico Industrial in Des Plaines, Illinois, and I'm Greg Spligert, but I'm the spokesperson for the Society of Manufacturing Engineers Local Chapter Number 5, and we have an important announcement. The Society of Manufacturing Engineers and Local Chapter 5 are pleased to support the Advanced Manufacturing Education Program at the Leiden High Schools in Franklin Park, Illinois. The school has been selected by the SME Educational Foundation to receive the prestigious Partnership Response in Manufacturing Education, or PRIME Scholarship Program. Congratulations! The PRIME initiative identifies the need for collaboration between industry leaders, educators, parents, and students. Leiden has earned this designation due to the following factors. The commitment of its instructors and administration to manufacturing excellence at its facilities with STEM curriculum and accreditations and certifications. The motivated students who are enrolled in the program with access to internships, scholarships, job training, and real world experience. The strong local community support from manufacturers who have established a Leiden Technology Council to work with both students and educators in Franklin Park, Schiller Park, Melrose Park, and Harwood Heights. The restoration of the Manufacturing Technology Program at the West Leiden High School, and the long-term relationships with industry associations such as the Technology and Manufacturing Association, TMA, and the Society of Manufacturing Engineers. Leiden High Schools are one of only 38 schools in the United States that have been chosen as a prime school, and they have set an impressive example for the future of manufacturing education. SME Chapter 5 and the Educational Foundation are proud to present this visual tribute to the many stakeholders who have made Leiden High School so successful and this a model for cooperation between the community and education. Hi, I'm Frank Holthaus. I am the Industrial Technology Department Chair here at Leiden High Schools. I chair both the East and the West Campus. Our classes directly relate to industry and uh, it's great to teach students about uh, the real worlds and open some doors for them. In my 10 years here, I've taught a variety of classes our Metals 1, our Metals 2 courses, our Exploring Technology courses, and our Project Lead the Way courses, which are our pre-engineering courses. Besides those variety of preps, it's been great to watch students go through Leiden, you know, begin as a freshman, do their four years, take a variety of classes, and then finally end up in the industry. When I first started, we probably only had about four industrial tech teachers, and as uh, we've gone on, we now have six industrial tech teachers, and so that's two full teachers that we've grown, and, and one in just the last year, and that's really all about students being interested in manufacturing and industrial technology. At our East program, we have 60 students, and at our West program that was just brought online this year, we have an additional 100 students. So that's 160 students that are taking classes that are relevant to our local community and our local manufacturers. We're really proud that we're NIMS accredited, uh, NIMS is the National Institute for Metalworking Skills. All of our instructors, including myself, are NIMS certified. Now we have both those labs together. We can really uh, have twice the output and twice the impact on our local community and manufacturers. Um, I'm Mike Maddox. I'm the instructor at East Leiden High School for the metalworking program. This is my fourth year here. If we look around the shop, we definitely have a more high-tech shop than we did 10 years ago. And really what that indicates for our program is we try to maintain our integrity with the field and we try to maintain our relevance in the field. So when the field starts going more CNC, we make an investment and we start going more CNC. So we actually have one of the better shops in the state, if not the country. Uh, I'm Angelo Banaka. I go to East Leiden High School. I am a junior and I am a manufacturing student in Metals II. Uh, currently, we're learning how to work on these machines, which are mills and the lays. We're learning how to program them and how to use them basic, basic functions and make a part out of it. 
Mi nombre es Hilda Mendoza. Estoy en las clases de ingeniería desde hace el año pasado. I really uh, learned how to work in a very large group with different projects and also I learned to uh, design in CAD. So it was pretty much fun. Hi, I'm Isaiah Torres from East Leiden High School. I'm currently a senior. I've been enrolled in the East Leiden Medals too for two years now. Yeah, we've pretty much learned how to write our own program how to create code, read code, um, working on the machine, setting them up. Hi, my name is Eric Ochino. I'm a senior at East Line High School and I'm currently taking a Metals 2 class. I've learned how to measure in uh, measurements that I've never learned before. My name is Liam, I'm 18. I'm a senior at East Line High School in the manufacturing program in Metals 2. Been learning everything from how to run manual lathes, mills, and uh, other machines and how to operate them. Hi, my name is Jesse Modulera. I'm 17 years old, senior at East Line High School, and I'm currently enrolled in Metals 2. Metals 2, we're all CNC, making G-codes. I am working right now at EJ Bassler. It is a, uh, it's a machine shop in Chiller Park. It's a large shop. We have tons of different machines, all kinds of different machines. Yeah, I work for Robert C. Weissite Company and I'm in the lathe department. Uh, I'm a machine operator there. During the summer, full-time, and currently, part-time. Because I already have some knowledge of how to measure, how to read them a code, work on the machines, I actually was promoted in the job that I had. Hi, my name is Greg Tomchuk. I am a 2012 Leiden graduate, and right now I'm studying at UIC. I am studying mechanical engineering, trying to get a bachelor's degree, and I'm planning on going into the automotive field with that. Mam na imię Paweł Schnadel, a pracuję w Manor Tool Schiller Park. Jestem tutaj jako apprentice for Tool and Die. A pracuję już tutaj dwa lata. Chodziłem do West Leiden. I, I never knew what tool and die was. I never even heard of stamping industry or the, any part of this molding or stamping, anything. Once I started working here, I fell in love with this. I mean, I have worked two years and a month now. Started in the tool room. Uh, my responsibilities were to keep everything clean for sure, for, for at first. Then they moved me up into uh, using the bridge boards, manual, manual lays, manual, uh, See, uh, my manual machines and once I started using those I started grinding so basically any sharpening for the tools to keep them keep them working for our production and actually learn that my biggest responsibility is to keep on learning for now as, a, as, as an apprentice and I also set up turret machine a uh, turret machine I program and then I set it up and I run it so my name is Bill Brubaker I am currently the engineering manager here at Robert Weissite company I graduated from East Leiden in 1987. I've been working here since I graduated, so I've been working here uh, over 28 years. Parts are a lot more difficult than they were in the past, plus the uh, technology of the machines, the inspection equipment, the computer software. My name is Mickey Radovojevich. I am the quality manager here at Qualiseal Technology, and I graduated East Leiden in 1996. My role is primarily to make sure we meet all our customer requirements, and at the end of the day, that we're shipping good product. Hi, my name is Dominic Gullick, and I work at Qualiseal Technology as a manufacturing engineer. I've graduated East Leiden High School in 2006. I started working at Qualiseal as a sophomore. I am a manufacturing engineer, and as a manufacturing engineer, I create the process to make the part. So that's creating all the steps from machining to all the platings, all the coatings, to a complete part. My name is Jerry Jablonski. I'm a design engineer at Qualiseal Technology and I graduated Leiden High School in 2007. I am a design engineer here, here at Qualiseal. In collaboration with other engineers, I design custom sealing applications specific to our customers' needs for industrial, aerospace, and other industries. Uh, my name is Alejandro Limon. I work for Robert C. Weiss and Company. I'm the manager of turning department. Uh, me gradué en el 2001. It introduced me to a field that I didn't even know existed. It got me my job here that I'm still, 15 years later, still working here.
we're part of an advisory council that consists of around 30 member companies and we meet monthly. They come to our shop, they look at what we're doing, they offer us suggestions, they offer us input. They also do offer us either donations of equipment or materials and even monetary donations if we're looking for new pieces of equipment. So when we look around and we see multiple CNC machines, a lot of that is in part due to the companies that we work with. And we built such a strong relationship, they invest in our program, and then we end up sending them qualified students who have entry level skills that they can take and then train in their specific environment to be able to do the jobs that they're hoping to do. And they're offering our students highly paid, very, satisfa very satisfying careers that most high schoolers don't even know exist. Hi, my name is Bob Weisheit Jr. and I'm the president of Robert C. Weisheit Company. We're a 50 person machine shop making parts for the Department of Defense and other national security applications. We're located in Franklin Park, Illinois. Approximately 30 years ago, I started working on the advisory council of East Leiden High School, along with about 10 other manufacturing company owners. And over the years, we have helped the instructors develop program plans and uh, what the students would be experiencing after their high school uh, training. My name is Rob Stubing. I'm the vice president, general manager of Koala Seal Technology. We are a designer and manufacturer of mechanical seals, primarily for the aerospace market, as well as some specialized industrial applications. I cannot begin to tell you how excited we are to be part of this program, as it is our way of sharing with the community and getting tomorrow's employees into our workforce. And there is no better way for us to capture the attention uh, in the hearts of the, the, the younger generation and show them what can become of working through the program and landing an opportunity for them somewhere in the future uh, in the manufacturing sector. We're really excited about the partnership with SME and being able to rely on SME and their expertise for projects throughout the year. I think the reason that we received the Prime Award we're very grateful for was because of the dedication of the faculty uh, and the dedication of the 10 or 12 uh, advisory council members, which are the uh, uh, managers or owners of the local manufacturing companies. I think also that the, the longevity that some of the students have come out of that program have experienced in the work, in, in the, in the work world has also been uh, exemplary of the system works when the industry and the staff get together and work on uh, training and finding jobs for the students. If I were to tell a new student in my program some of the things that are really important to be successful in, in this area but even in, in other areas is I would say the main one and I hear this from the companies I work with they don't necessarily care if you come in totally proficient in all of the skills that you need to be successful in their environment. What they mostly care about is your attitude and the attitude that I'm ready to work, I'm ready to learn. If you have that, they can take you from the ground up and teach you everything you need to know. You don't need to know all of the fine details or all of the, all of the skills that you'll know 10, 20 years from now. They don't expect that. It's really about the attitude and the work ethic. We have been extremely blessed with the students coming through the Leiden program. These kids have come to us with an open mind and really searching for an opportunity. And we have captured that, embraced that, and could not be more pleased with the outcome that we have received from their willingness to apply themselves, to become part of our team. Uh, and then we go the further step in continuing their education as they have come on board up to and including college degrees in uh, fields of engineering or quality assurance or manufacturing technologies. 